Hello world, where are you from in Japan? This is what a park is like. Well, it's probably more accurate to say that this is what some parks in Tokyo are like. But anyways, in Tokyo, there are lots of bridges, elevated highways, and railroad tracks. You often find parks nestled under them. At almost every park, you'll find a water fountain where you can both drink from and wash things off with. And of course, there's usually a place to relieve yourself. Stink. Stink. I'm always impressed with the efforts of the locals to make the concrete jungle a bit more like a real jungle. Here's the park we're going to today, but it's not your average street corner or under the bridge park. This one's a special river park located in the Edogawa Ward. This is the start of the map, and let's go! So, they call this a river park, but where I'm from, they'd call this a stream. Where are you, Shane? In the hole! Yeah. I'm gonna go on top of it. It's too little so don't do it, okay? Only, like, kids. I think you can do it. See? It's easy. So here you go, Shin. You did it. The park is several kilometers long, and along the way, there are several places to chill. Since the park spans multiple city blocks, we're constantly passing over these little bridges. While this bridge is not really a bridge, there are plenty of landscaped features that are designed to have you jumping back and forth along the stream. Like with most Japanese nature, and I say that with air quotes, every part of it is the result of a human's touch. Even though I wouldn't call the nature natural, I would call it beautiful. <laughs> I bet you thought that was the boys' washroom. In case you're wondering, kids are not discouraged from playing in the water. Is it locked? Because it's springtime only. It needs to be summertime before they unlock it. And in the summer, shower stations are open for the kids to use. Here's one of the water play areas that's being redone. The other side was still open though, and came complete with an evil hair. Yeah, it's evil! And not so evil tortoise. Rapunzel let go of hair. And swings made from Rapunzel's hair. Rapunzel, let go of your hair! The puzzle here is dirty because everybody put their shoes on and they like shoes on like like toilets if they have poop on it. Yeah. Or some pee pee. Yeah. Or some bugs. I've never thought about it, but yeah, Rapunzel's hair has got to be pretty gross. We started off way over that side. But we did. Yeah, and now we're going all the way to the boat. 
Well, I was looking the wrong way. I was like, I thought I was here and then going here. Okay, that makes a lot of sense. We interrupt our regularly scheduled programming for a comb beanie break. I, I'm thinking this or this or this. Konbini means convenience store, and anytime you're in Tokyo, you're never too far away from a konbini. So we drop by to get some snacks. This flavor is so yummy, Daddy. And what did you get? This. These are hot? Yeah, these are hot. Back to our regularly scheduled programming. Okay. We found the boat, and we were even able to do some whale watching. After playing with the boats and whales, we hit up the little kid park to check out the dinosaurs. I'm pretty sure this roller slide was made for three-year-olds, but I think the kids were able to roll with it. Get it? Roll with it? Ah ha 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 ha. Who... Thanks for watching. See you next time. Bye. What's a park like where you're from? The yes, you can, and you are the only. Daddy, and you need to go on there and count, Daddy. So don't film when we play tag, Daddy. Yeah, that's enough filming. Time to go play with the kids. It's kind of dark in here. Kids? 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 Are you coming to find me? Yeah.